All right, well, as the number of coronavirus cases around the globe continues to rise, researchers are working on a vaccine. Our next guest, Neil Browning, is a member of, a, or rather a participant in a coronavirus vaccine trial right now. Uh, so, Neil, thanks for joining the program. I guess tell us a little bit more about how you got involved with this, um, when you were given the vaccine, and, and how you're feeling right now. Sure. So I was uh, introduced to this uh, via a friend on Facebook. I looked at it. It seemed like something It was well suited for me, not too high a risk. Uh, a lot of rewards if we can help in this sooner. So I threw my name in the hat and got selected. Uh, a week ago this morning, I was given the first dose of the experimental vaccine. And now had you um, had any symptoms? Do you know anyone that had any symptoms uh, before this or, or had you been feeling fine? And I'm assuming that as part of the vaccine, they did test you for whether or not you have COVID-19. Yes, absolutely. I was fully tested. I need to make sure that I'm not exposed to it. This is a new type of vaccine that actually does not have any type of the virus weakened or dead as a part of it. So I need to make sure I'm completely clear, no symptoms, nothing. And I'm in a higher state of lockdown than a lot of people usually are in this state right now. And how many other uh, participants are there in this trial? And, and what's your timeline? I guess if you're right now in a in a pretty um, serious self-quarantine situation, what's your timeline looking like uh, for you to return uh, to something like normal life? So there are 45 total participants in three groups of 15. Uh, I'm in the small dosage. There's another medium dosage and a large dosage, basically to figure out where the sweet spot is to make sure that they don't give too much, but give enough to give an immune response if this is going to work. Um, I'm in where basically I don't go anywhere except for once a week. I have to drive into the same research facility where I was administered the vaccine and donate blood for them to uh, run through analysis and see how my body's reacting to it. At four weeks out from the initial injection, I'll get a booster and go through another four weeks of every week going in for a blood draw. Hey investors, Zach Guzman here. Are you interested in learning more about the markets and getting the latest financial news? Well then click right here to subscribe to our Yahoo Finance YouTube channel. Get the latest up to the minute market analysis, big interviews in the world of finance and information on how to manage your money every day wherever you are.